Hi, I'm Brad from What the Tech. Today, we're going to be talking about laptop operating systems. When buying a new laptop, one of the first decisions you have to make is which operating system, or OS, to buy. For some, the decision is easy. They just get whatever operating system they had on their last laptop. For people buying their first computer, looking for a change, or just curious about what options are out there, this video will offer a brief overview of the three most common laptop operating systems you can get when buying a laptop from the store. Windows, Mac OS, and Chrome OS. Microsoft's Windows is by far the most used computer operating system out there. According to HostingTribunal.com, Windows runs on nearly 79% of all laptops and desktops. One of the benefits of being the most popular OS is the sheer number of laptop device manufacturers and device styles that you can get that run Windows, all the way from a small 10-inch tablet to an 18-pound 21-inch laptop. Windows has more options than Chrome OS or Mac OS by far. Another benefit to the huge market share is that most software can run on Windows. Because the majority of laptops run Windows, it's very much to the benefit of software developers to make their software available to the biggest operating system. This is especially true with games. If your primary desire in a new laptop is to play games or just general software compatibility, a Windows laptop is the obvious choice. Apple's Mac OS is the second most popular operating system with about a 15% market share. The big difference between Mac OS compared to Chrome OS and Windows is that Mac OS only runs on laptops and desktops created by Apple. The primary downside to this approach is the lack of software and especially hardware variety. However, an upside to this approach is the increased speed and ease of use all across the Mac OS operating system. Apple's control over both the hardware and the software does make for a very smooth day-to-day -day computing experience where all the software that you run is optimized specifically for the machine that you're running it on. This smooth experience is further amplified if you own other Apple devices like an iPad or an iPhone because your messages, phone calls, reminders, and notes all sync seamlessly between your devices in the Apple ecosystem. For some, the ease of use between these devices can be enough to offset the lack of hardware variety or increased cost of owning a macOS device. Another perk of owning an Apple laptop is the support provided by Apple. Every future operating system that your device can run will be free for the life of your laptop. Apple also offers free hardware and software training sessions in their stores, along with a much easier and faster repair process than most manufacturers. Chrome OS is the newest OS out of these three with a roughly 1.5% market share. Released in 2011 by Google, it gained much of its popularity in the K-12 education space. Chrome OS is centered around Google's web applications and is best for someone who wants to almost exclusively use web-based applications, and do general web browsing on their computer. Like Windows, there are many manufacturers who create Chrome OS devices, often at an incredibly low price in comparison to their Windows or Mac OS counterparts. While not ideal for professional software or gaming, a Chrome OS device is a fast and inexpensive solution if the work and play you do can be done inside of a web browser. Before buying a new laptop and deciding on an operating system, there are a couple of things you should consider. One, what software do you plan on running? If you're looking to play specific games or you have photo or video editing software that you plan on using, you'll first want to do your research and make sure to find out what operating systems are supported by that software. Two, what devices do you already own? there are definitely benefits to getting devices that are made to work together. As I mentioned earlier, iPhones and iPads work seamlessly with iOS, while Android phones can very easily pair to a Windows computer or a Chrome OS device. Often, the hassle of learning the ropes of an unfamiliar operating system can sour the experience of buying a new laptop. So if you are getting a new laptop with an operating system that you haven't used, 
be sure to keep an open mind before making the leap. If you're looking for a new laptop now, our website, whatthetech.io, has a laptop finder quiz that has up-to-date pricing on all of our recommended laptops. Just enter in the features and OS you're looking for, along with your desired price range, and we'll recommend great laptops from trusted brands that match your preferences. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, consider subscribing to our channel and be sure to check out whatthetech.io.